Well, I mean, it starts in your environment, right? So for a lot of young people, that's school. Uh, and it's really cool because this dialogue's happening right now. And I've been at several schools where young people are organizing different activist circles or uh, even talking about like how they can protect their Muslim brothers or sisters in the hallways if they're getting bullied or how to take a stand uh, against LGBTQIA students that are getting bullied or not being accepted. And it starts there. And it's really good because we're finally talking about it. And what's so powerful about Women's March is not just creating political change, but also cultural and social change. And that does come with the youth. And it's encouraging because even globally, an 11 year old organized our march in Scotland. Um, yeah, exactly, it's, it's amazing. Uh, but it's also mixed with the older generation of feminists. Like we had women, there was one woman that marched in DC in her wheelchair and she was like, I marched for my right to vote. I marched when Roe v. Wade passed and I'm marching with you all now and I'll keep marching. And that's the mentality we have to have. And the youth is the future. I might not see an end result or um, and everything resolved in my lifetime. It's about passing that on and making sure that the youth continues to fight, but it starts in their environment. I'd like to add something quickly to you, saying that um, one thing that I you know, faced even as a younger person is that a lot of times we don't know exactly where to plug in because there are like these elder, older folks who are sort of um, you know, like, like the gateway to doing things. I'm just gonna come out here and tell you, don't ask for permission, just do it. You know, you have better ideas than most older folks that I have met. And in every single circle that I've been in, young people are, not only are they our future, but they're also our present. And you are the people who are gonna bring about transformative change. If somebody is causing a barrier to, um, you know, whatever it is that your hopes and ambitions and dreams are, don't listen, just like go do your own thing. You know, don't ask for permission.